children today we will do exercise 8.2 page number 187 ncrt textbook first main third fourth and fifth sum to work out this we need this table here which i have taught you in uh, in the previous video the link for the same video will be given in the comment section right. let us get started we will start substituting the values of cos 45, second 30 and cosec 30. Cos 45 is 1 by root 2 divided by 2 by root 3 plus 2 by 1. Here 1 divided by root 2 divided by here root 3 and 1 LCM will be root 3. So this will be multiplied with 1. And this will be multiplied with root 3. So this becomes 2 plus 2 root 3. So now here main division line this one will take reciprocal 1 divided by root 2 into root 3 divided by 2 plus 2 root 3. Now root 3 divided by when you multiply this one put bracket here binomial to this becomes 2 root 2 plus 2 root 6 we will take this 2 common out which will reduce our work so it will be root 3 divided by 2 out common out root 2 plus root 6 I hope you remember 9 standard rationalizing denominator same we are doing here so it will be root 2 minus root 6 divided by root 2 minus root 6 numerator in numerator multiply this one here you get root 6 minus root 18 divided by this 2 right as it is this will be a plus b a minus b a square minus b square here so in numerator it will be root 6 minus root 18 root 18 I will write this as root of 9 into 2 that means 3 root 2 so in place of root 18 I will be writing 3 root 2 divided by this 2 as it is 2 here root 2 whole square square and square root cancel square and square root cancel 2 minus 6 will be minus 4 so here we will take root 6 minus 3 root 2 divided by minus 8 now whenever in trigonometry or negative sign is there in denominator and it is a single term pass the square uh, minus sign to numerator look what happens minus up here it will be minus root 6 minus into plus it will be root 3 divided by 8 so we will arrange it in a proper format that is 3 root 2 minus root 6 divided by 8 so this is our final required answer That's it. then next sum that is fourth sum of the first mean we will start sin 30 sin 30 values 1 by 2 plus 1 by 1 minus 2 by root 3 cosec 30 is 2 by root 3 divided by second 30 2 by root 3 plus 1 by 2 plus 1 so this 1 I will I am putting it as 1 by 1 now when you take up the LCM of 2 1 and 3 LCM here will be 2 root 3 LCM of 2 1 and root 3 is 2 root 3 now here check with the LCM 2 root 3 only 2 is there so we will multiply with root 3 this is 1 this you multiply with 2 root 3 then this is 3 of the LCM 2 then you, here you get root 3 plus 2 root 3 minus 4 divided by again here LCM will be root 3 2 and 1 so LCM here will be 2 root 3 same LCM is 2 root 3 here denominator is root 3 what is the other value missing 2 here it is 2 in this 2 is there so what is the other one that is will multiply with 
root 3 and this is 1 the whole thing has to be multiplied to root 3 then you get here 4 plus root 3 plus 2 root 3 look here we will, this is 1 root 3 plus 2 root 3 3 root 3 1 root 3 plus 2 root 3 will be 3 root 3 so we will write 3 root 3 minus 4 divided by 2 root 3 whole divided by 4 plus 3 root 3 divided by 2 root 3 when you take reciprocal these two get cancelled so here we get 3 root 3 minus 4 divided by 4 plus 3 root 3 again we have to rationalize the denominator before rationalizing keep it in the same form as it is in numerator since it is positive we can interchange these values look it will help us 3 root 3 minus 4 divided by here denominator I will keep it as 3 root 3 plus 4 now our rationalizing conjugate will be 3 root 3 minus 4 divided by 3 root 3 minus 4 hope you got it one change we have done here just to match up because see a minus b a minus b we will get it as a minus b whole square formula so just to get up to this one we have just shuffled up so this will be same a plus b a minus b we get a square minus b square i hope you got it at this point now continuing the same a minus b whole square formula you will get here a square 3 root 3 whole square my plus b square minus 2 into a into b whole divided by look here 3 square is 9 square and square root cancel you will get 9 into 3 27 minus 16 now look out here in numerator same thing 3 root 3 square and square root cancel 3 square 9 into 3 27 minus plus 16 minus here we get 2 into 3 6 into 4 it will be 24 root 3 divided by 11 so here we get 27 plus 16 43 minus 24 root 3 divided by 11 this is our final answer we cannot take anything common or nothing is common so this will be the final answer on substituting the values simplify rationalize denominator and the final answer now fifth sum fifth sum of first main 5 for square 60 plus 4 less will be here 5 as it is cos square 60 value is 1 by 2 whole square plus 4 of the question as it is second square 30 second 30 is 2 by root 3 whole square minus 1 square then sin square 30 sin 30 value is 1 by 2 whole square because it is square cos square 30 root 3 by 2 whole square practice more sum so that these values you will, it will be there in your mind it will help you to work out fast okay. next we will solve it here 5 into 1 by 4 plus 4 into 2 square 4 divided by square and square root cancel 3 minus 1 we will make it 1 by 1 yeah. in this it will be 1 by 4 plus square and square root cancel 3 by 4 so finally we will get here 5 by 4 plus 16 by 3 minus 1 by 1 whole divided by we will get it 4 by 4 fine in numerator we will take LCM for 4 3 and 1 it will be 12 so 12 into 3 into 4 into 12 5 3 15 plus it is 
sixty four minus twelve divided by four by four is one. Now continue. This will be how much seventy nine fifteen plus sixty four seventy nine minus twelve divided by twelve. Do not cancel this one. Not allowed. So the final answer will be sixty seven divided by twelve. So this is the final answer. So ten standard part is only substituting the values. You have to remember the value or draw the table as soon as possible within one minute and then continue with the sum. See to that you do the simplification correctly. So this is exercise eight point two, first main, third, fourth and fifth sum. Thank you.